the theme park experience. It's the opening day of... <clears throat> Sorry about that. It's the opening day of the theme park. You find yourself being tasked by your boss to work hard. It seems like an easy job until someone breaks in. You're not alone. All right, so this one has to do with, like, you know, a theme park. So it's not going to be bad, right? Oh. Elgato Awful Industries. Yay. Okay, but in all seriousness, though, we also have another experience horror game, The Bank Experience by Mystery Game Dev. Um, after getting a night shift position at the local bank, you start to experience odd things that happen around the building. Can you survive the killer, or will you be the latest victim? But damn, this safe fire guy makes all, really makes every single thumbnail for, like, groups like these, huh? But yeah, it's not an experience horror game video by me if it doesn't, like, include, like, many experience horror games. Like, from, like, 2 to, like, 10 or whatever, you know? And yeah, one has to involve around theme parks, and one has to involve around banks. I mean, I, I, I would have honestly liked it more if, like, the bank experience would have been, like, at, like, a, you're a robber and you rob the bank and stuff, and then you realize it's, like, a trap or whatever, you know? And, like, and, like the past gets to you or whatever, like, but wh whatever, I couldn't really care less. Anyways, let's play the theme park experience by El, El Gato Alpha Industries. If you guys don't know, let's just say I don't kind of like some of their experience horror games and stuff, you know? <clears throat> and... <clears throat> Clear my throat sometimes. And I, mm, Jesus, fuck. And I like, to, uh, I, I'm, I want to address something about these experience horror games real quick before I get straight into the video, you know? I don't exactly hate these experience horror games. Like, if you look at, like, YouTubers like Freddy and stuff, like, they don't like experience horror games and stuff because it get, keeps getting milked and milked and milked. And I can see that. I can see that. But what I like about some of these experiences and stuff is that some of them are original. Like, like, the thing is about me as a Roblox YouTuber and stuff, I usually judge, like, games like these by their originality and stuff. Like, if, like, here's the thing, though. Like, if, if a, if a genre of games, like, get, like, milked as hard and stuff, like, I, I really don't care, honestly. I, I could really care less and stuff, but, but, like, I, I just worry, I just only worry about their originality and stuff. Like, if you really want to milk, if you really want to milk a game, like, a genre of a game and stuff, then at least make your story original, you know? Like, take the Ghost Hunter experience. That's made by El Gato Industries, and that's one of the only one, only experience horror games that I like from them. And that's just, and here's the thing, like, like that's supposed to be original and stuff, because if you don't know, experience horror games like these and stuff involve around, you know, like, um, like, basically involve, like, around, like, you know, a serial kills on the loose, or there's, like, a creepy monster, like, roaming around your area, and it's going straight to your location, you know? Like, the thing is, I've seen that multiple damn times from games like these, and nowadays, I really don't care if, like, like, the experience horror game genre, do like, gets milked so hard and stuff, even though it's already been almost a year since the Night Shift experience comes came out, and, like, th this is still happening stuff like i really don't care okay I, i'm just saying that like i just only worry about if if they get if like the devs are able to make it original you know like like if you take like shamuri like studios and stuff like you know they may most most of their game most of their experience horror games are actually original like take the strain experience or whatever you know like what else um yeah you get it so yeah let's just let's just hope Let's just hope that the theme park experience is at least a little, like, you know, original. And and not so cringy with, like, the boss saying, It's just nothing. Get back to work or whatever. Yeah, yeah, you get it. That's That's what also happens in almost every single game of these. But, yeah, let me just shut the fuck up already and let's just get straight into the theme park experience. Damn. No one could really bother, like, playing this game, huh? Alright, anyways, um, let's just join this, I guess. Since even though there's already... Another person in here, which I don't know where... Oh, there we are. There we are. But, I mean, obviously, he's not even going to join me and stuff. So, yeah, why bother? All right. Here we go. Theme park experience. Can't get this damn thing off my screen. All right. Let's do this. Theme park experience. Let's see if it's original. Night one. Opening night. I refuse to play this on full volume because I already, I already know that this could have, like, very... Like, very, like... Yay. So, like, here I turn on the lights, it's very fucking dark here. Uh, okay, first of all, why is there a fucking Glock? Okay, yeah. 
Oh, I, I guess there's like fireworks, huh? Alright, turn on the lights on to the park. Okay, no, that's just a gun. Um, Ah, right over there, you know, it always shows the exclamation marks, which really helps me in these experience horror games, so. Oh. Is that like supposed to be like some... I can't really tell what that is because it's too damn dark in here. Alright. Um, okay. I can only really hear the clock ticking. Alright. Let's just turn on power. Here we go. Boom. Oh, okay. Shut up. There we go. Yeah. Oh, okay. Where, where, do you, where exactly are the prizes? You don't tell me. All right. What, what, a, what animal is this? Is it, it looks like a... I don't know what it is exactly. Like, maybe like a black lion or whatever. I don't... Look, I don't know. Okay, shut up. All right. Not my fault that I don't know most of the damn animals and stuff. Alright. Let's just place these down. Teddy bears, yeah. Let's just place these down. And then we have to do this multiple more times because, of course, you know, like, we have to stay here as long as we can for those premium payouts, huh? Yeah. <clears throat> what, so you can... Oh, I know, never mind. Alright. <clears throat> Wait, why are the cars I throw this like a lot this time? Uh God fucking damn Who is that? What what I tell you? He's gonna say at least get back to work at least once. Uh, okay. You don't have to fucking rush me. What if I don't, huh? You're gonna fire me? You're gonna send me to detention or whatever? Lunch detention? Alright. Anyways. <clears throat> why do I have to clear my throat like Quite a lot this time. I mean, I I really just woke up, so like, no shit. I mean, whatever. Really, it doesn't matter. All right. Now I need to turn on. Wait, why is it red? The famous rides. Yay! Are you trying to make me like? Are you trying to make me like you know like be like be happy about this? Because I'm not, so. All right. Okay. So the exclamation marks are all the way over there. So let's just go straight over there. Voila. Do not press. What if I do? And we can't press it. So I guess that's gonna be useful for later, huh? And I bet that's gonna happen. All right. And of course, the boss only cares about the millions of dollars and stuff. Like, is it, like, is the boss the antagonist or is the killer the antagonist, huh? Like, like it makes it, it makes us think that the boss is like, like all right, night two, the encounter, all right. So yeah, a day has passed. Okay, I mean, I do. You really open the park this early? Okay, when did this trash even? All right, never mind. I mean, it's an experience horror game. We have we have to at least pick up like, like a few pieces of trash. It that's, like that's a rule of like these experience horror games. Like, if you don't have trash in the game, then yeah, it's not considered our experience horror. The fuck? Is that the trash I picked up or? I don't. Know. At this point, I could really care less. All right. I mean, please, for the love of God, just don't make, like, the, whatever that thing was. Like, just have, like, a stupid plan. Like, I'm going to take over this theme park and stuff. It'll be all mine for what you did. Like, like j just please. I'll li what, at least make him actually menacing and stuff. But, like, you know, I mean, well, it's uh, El Gato for the in Industries. What do you expect? So, they, they literally had at least one experience horror game that I actually enjoyed and stuff, you know? Like, the Ghost Hunter experience. Even though it was literally just Ghostbusters, really. I don't know. Anyways. Oh no. Did you turn off the power? No, I played with it. I don't care. Just leave. Son of a bitch. Okay. Now let me guess. It's gonna <clears throat> Jesus Christ. Alright, let me guess. It's gonna jump scare me after I fix the power. Huh. Because El Gato really likes to do that, huh? Ah,
okay. Okay, why specifically this Ferris wheel? Mm. Okay, what did the Ferris wheel do to you? I need help. Okay, hold on. What did the Ferris wheel do do to you, huh? Like, what? What did you get bullied on the Ferris wheel on Disney Channel or whatever? Like, what? All right. Also, why the fuck? All right. No mind. And let me guess, he's not gonna believe us. <gasps> boss, boss, boss. He's not gonna believe us, huh? Tell us to get back to work and stuff. There was a man. He said he was gonna destroy the park. He's not gonna believe us. He's not gonna believe us. He's not gonna believe us. I told you. What I tell you? He... Oh my fucking god! All right. See, this is what I also hate about all god awful industries and stuff. Like, like, like it, he makes the bosses like feel like they're the main antagonist at this point. Like, like they only care about money almost every single time and stuff. Like, all right. Uh, wait, it, it's literally the same person. What the hell? All right, night three, the bomb. Wait, so this takes place in our rack? Oh, what? Oh, of course. I mean, at least you're... Uh, I mean, at least you're kind of smart now. I'm, or, I mean, you can at least, like, you know, like, bring in, like, you know, security guards and stuff instead of, you know, like, just security cameras. I ain't gonna do shit, most likely. What is this, FNAF? Anyways. We're gonna set up cameras, alright. <clears throat> Let's just set up these cameras. Even though he's most likely gonna just break them all and stuff. I mean, you could have at least just, like, actually had security guards as well, you know? Since, you know, you have millions of dollars, you can, like, pay security guards and stuff. Whatever, alright. Alright. Let's just place all these down. Okay, what? Okay, who is even sending out all those fireworks, huh? Alright. <clears throat> Sorry, just a bit. Yeah, all it is just play, place five cameras. Alright. Grab alarms from storage. Alright, set up all alarms. Alright. Oh, God. Okay, that just looks like a button. <clears throat> Wait, exit sign? Alright. Okay, okay, wow. Okay, what? why are exit signs so important? Like, people do know how to exit, right? Or is there something that I don't know about exit signs, huh? Because, you know, I'm still in middle school. I don't know jack shit about, like, history yet. Whatever. Alright. So let me guess. Those boxes are going to be useful for later, huh? Alright, set up all signs. Alright. Alright, well, two of them are, like, literally... Hold on. Oh, okay. Or at least this is not so difficult. All right. Wait, he actually said please? Wow, that was very impossible for a boss in, for Elgato Alpha Industries. <gasps> wow. All right, let's check the cameras, I guess. Wait, who? Where are you? Ah, I'm so scared. Run to the gates, oh no. Oh no, he's gonna get me, oh no. Help me, oh no. Oh wait, am I supposed to be like, scared? Oh, okay, two minutes. Okay, why am I- Oh, so for once you're actually smart, huh? All right. Go call the SWAT team, all right? Great, the batteries are are low again, so. What's your emergency? 
Some guy wants to destroy the theme park. He plans to strike today. We need you guys. Please tell me this is a dream. Nah, that's where we left, baby. Alright, go check the security room. Wait, oh. Of course, I was literally in the security room, so... Damn it, alright. Okay, I don't fucking see him. Okay. I didn't realize I never even used my flashlight. Or sound the alarms. Where the fuck are the alarms? Oh. Ah. It's the button. See what I tell you. Sound the alarms! Try escaping. Alright, well, where the... Alright. Alright, let me just get the hell out of here. Finally I'm done with the shit. It's not like... It's not like it's gonna be locked or whatever. <laughs> no, why would they do that? <laughs> oh. Okay, am I really? All right. See, I can't even click. God damn. I guess we just have to wait to see what it's gonna pick since it doesn't let me choose most of the time. So. Wait, try to escape. Oh shit. Okay. Um. Um. All right. Let's get the hell out of here. I guess. If, it, if the batteries die or like right at the sec. All right. <clears throat> there we go. Eaten ending. Finally. Yay. All right. Finally have the bank experience. Welcome to Row Bank. I always get the night shifts. Well, at least th this one's actually, like, you know. Like, all right, whatever. Anyway, I have to look at this as a new opportunity. I'm going to wait for a customer. Okay, I guess we should, yep. <clears throat> all right, well, we got a phone here, so I guess that's useful for later. All right, we just got a little break room, I guess. We got, of course, the vault, since this is a bank. What else do we have? Um, oh, hello. Oh shit. Um, hi there. <clears throat> Jeez, I have to clear my throat so many times. Take the order. Oh. Okay. Money bag. All right. All right. Bye bye. It's an easy job. Yeah, what could possibly go wrong? It's not like there's gonna be a killer on the loose, right? <laughs> right? Wait, was that someone? Hello? Oh. Alright, the cop, alright. Here you oh, oh wait, yeah. No mind. Okay. Now we just grab I get yeah, the money bag again, I guess. Well like the briefcase or and mon like is that like money going to be useful? But I don't even know. All right, just take the money bag. The boss told me that <clears throat> he had to check the printers. I guess that's going to be in here. Yep, check printer. All right. Boom chakalaka. Boom dini donny. I I don't even know what I'm speaking at this point. All right, and I guess it's just gonna be at that window again. Hey, flashlight. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, that. Oh, and it's the cop again. Um. All right. All right, there we go. I'm going to check the cameras. If there is any are any problems in the fall, I could lose the job. I guess it's gonna be in here then, huh? Nope, it's literally just over there. All right then. Check camera. Oh, well, 
Okay, this phone is like the camera. Okay, then. I was honestly expected it to be like, you know, a computer. Alright, well, I don't see anyone, so. Okay, that's, that's most likely the fault, so. There is nothing unusual. I'm going to eat something. Alright. Guess we just go over it. Nope, that is the wrong way. Of course, I'm, I always go the wrong way, just thought you know. Alright. Alright, what is gonna be in here? Wait, is that? <laughs> Smudge! Take a burger, alright? Burger. And then we just cook it. Why, why is it like frozen so How long has the burger been in there and stuff? Like, 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 no, like, literally. How long has the bigger burger been in there? Ever since this bank opened, like, in the 1920s or whatever, you know? Jesus Christ. All right. Hello? Oh, and it's the cop again. All right, then. Damn, does he really need that much money? Wait until he finds out about the loans and stuff. All right. Take, oh, now it's the briefcase, I guess. All right. All right, money suitcase. What? Yeah, whatever. Same thing. Which is really just Gucci from what it looks like. All right. All right, bye-bye. See you later, most likely. I'm going to leave all the employees' work on their desk, and then I can go. All right, where exactly is that? Here? Yep. All right, take papers. All right, can I just grab them all at once? Well, yeah. I mean, obviously, so. Obviously, there's going to be, like, four nights or whatever, you know? All right. And then we just leave the... Yep, all right. Leave the papers on the desk. Okie dokie. Let me guess. One... Let me guess. One... When I do one of these, like... Like, what... Like, the computer's gonna show, like, a spooky face and stuff, you know, to, like, scare me. And obviously, I will get scared and stuff, since, you know, I'm scared to check in. All right. There we go. Alright, oh jeez, okay. Night two, behind you. Walter White! Alright, night two. Second night here. I hope I don't have too much work. Wait for a customer, alright, and then of course we wait for another customer. There's like a difference with like El Gato Industries and Mystery Game Dev. Like one of them <clears throat> just get, just like, you know. Like, just doesn't have, or, okay, all right. All right, one basically just makes us do a lot of, lot of tasks, and just, one, like, one of them just, like, m like, one of them, um, like, you know, makes us wait for customers almost every single, like, fucking time we do a task, you know? Like this. So, wait. <laughs> Is that a min- Time to prepare all the papers. Oh, and once again, all right. Alright, now we just place them on desk once again. Alright. Oh no. What what? Wait, what? Huh? What? Whoa, 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 huh? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Huh? Okay, this just turned turned straight into weird trick dad. What? Must close the door within twenty sec huh? Whoa, 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 I'm sorry. Son of a bitch. Okay, where is that assault rifle game pack? Okay, you must see in room for the long, otherwise you die. You must close the with them to my side, otherwise you die. You must survive until 6 a.m. Okay. Alright. So, yeah, this literally just turned into Weird Trick Dad or whatever, huh? Yeah, you have to, like, eat and drink and stuff, otherwise you die, and, yeah. Alright.
All right, so it's just going to make that noise and stuff. Is like, okay. So, yeah, we have 20 seconds to actually, like, do that and stuff. Otherwise, we're screwed, so. So where is Oak? I'm trying to find that goddamn. So yeah, this is pretty easy, honestly. So yeah, trust me, I played a lot of weird, like those weird tricks ripoffs and stuff, like weird trick uncle uncles. So I I know what I'm doing. I did play a little bit of weird trick dad and stuff. So yeah, I'm doing my own thing. That's what I was where else to say. All right, see, we're already at 4 a.m. See, that's why time flies, huh? And these games like these like just show that a lot, huh? Close it. Just how long were these burgers in that damn, like, freezer and stuff? Like, what? Like, I don't fucking know. Like, Now we go back over here quickly. I suppose we're gonna do it one more time before, like, oh, and there we go. <sighs> Yay! I think it's over. Well, now it's six a.m. So, oh shit! I'll just check the cameras just in case. I guess someone's in like the fall, huh? I know it's gonna jump scare me in like that fall camera. Oh. Okay, never mind. Oh, normal. I have to get on with the job. Okay, and then we're just gonna keep going then. Check the printers, all right. Yes, we have to go check the printers then, huh? Time to eat. Finally. All right. Now we just go eat another burger that's been there since, like, World War II or whatever. I don't know. Like, ever since McDonald's opened up and stuff, you know? Are we going to have to do one of the, like, that thing, like, the survive? I swear there was nothing there when I got there. I need to clean this up immediately. Oh, yeah, we're just not going to worry about what it says and stuff. Yeah, get a sponge. SPONGEBOB! All right, night three. You are never alone. I know. All right. Third night here. I hope nothing strange happens like yesterday. It might seem crazy when I'm about to wait for a customer. All right, just gotta wait for another customer at night. I'm turning my back and stuff just in case if they try to jump scare me, you know? Mm, oh, gotta answer the phone then, huh? I wonder who it could be. 
Who is it? Hello. I had a small accident on the road next to the bank. Can you help me? You know, it's been a while since I heard that in any experience horror game and stuff. Hmm. Okay. I'll be right there. Alright, go help the injured person. Yep, and of course, it's not gonna be an, 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 an injured person and stuff. It's gonna be, you know, the monster and stuff. And boy, is this a pointless, like, world and stuff. Alright. Then we have to go run back. Oh, it's... It was a lion. I should call 911. Call 911, alright. Well, I mean, at least they weren't lying, though. But, I mean, Reynolds Pro... As I was saying, it's... Okay, yeah. It's probably, like, the monster in the skies or whatever, you know? Whatever. I mean, at least we don't... At least it didn't... wasn't, like, go help them and then just take run back to the house and shit hello can you hear me i hear you perfectly what is your emergency there is the dead body of an old man by the side of the road understood where are you right now I'm at Row Bank. I'm doing the night shift. Perfect. Help is on the way. Let me guess. We're gonna have to do the we're shook out thing all over. Okay, never. And we're just still gonna take orders and stuff. Okay. Me must leave all the papers now. The night shift is about to end. All right. There we go. Answer the phone. Alright, guess that's gonna be, you know, the monster. Who is it? Hello? We are the police. Could you come out and explain what happened? Yep, that's gonna be the monster. I'm just gonna say right now, it's gonna be the monster. I'm gonna tell. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? What did I run or hide? Well, obviously we're gonna fucking run. It's gonna be the good ending, isn't it? Run ending. Well chosen. You ran out of the place and the killer couldn't catch you. What I tell you, it's always the running ending that's the good ending. Well, yeah, that was the theme park ending and the bank, or, no, no, shit. Um, that was the theme park, um, experience and the bank experience. Um, the theme park experience was basically just your typical Elgato Awful Industries, um, experience horror game and stuff, you know, where, like, the killer just wants to destroy the whole place and stuff, you know, like, yeah, you get it. And, and the thing is, what I actually lo liked about the bank experience is that they didn't fool out, like, you know, like, explain, like, the monster and stuff, you know? Like, it, it, like, they basically, they basically just, like, never, like, 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 okay. Yeah, things like these, I'm not really gonna explain it. Yeah, like, the thing about other experience horror games, it was where it, it, like, where they just, like, full out just, like, show, like, what the killer looks like and stuff, you know? And so that they, we can know, like, what the, like, main antagonist is. But for the bank experience, though, like, we never, like, you, we never really see what the monster looks like and stuff, like, until, like, the very end and stuff. Like, like... Yeah, yeah, and, and it was kind of different from, like, other experience horror games and stuff, 
you know, like it, like he has some similarities with the lighthouse and experience and stuff, like where he had to like survive for an amount of time and stuff, you know, like with, from the monster. And if I had to pick between the bank experience and the theme park experience, I probably had to go with the bank experience and, and stuff, you know, like it doesn't like they don't like say that he's like a kill or whatever, or just like a creepy monster that's on the loose or whatever. So like that, so like we're able to like try to make theories on what this thing could possibly be, you know. Or it's probably just going to be a monster on lose. Well, whatever. But yeah, in my opinion, bank experience is better than the theme park experience. Sorry, theme park experience, but you're out. But anyways, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you have any other experience horror games that you want me to play and stuff, or if you want me to play an update from a rural experience that I did play before, then suggest them on the group wall in my Roblox group, the Puggy Buzz YT group. You can either click the link in the description below that has a very long paragraph, or you can just do a long way to turn your Roblox group, so Puggy Buzz YT group, and it's most likely to be the first one to pop up. Um, and here's the thing, though, about the Puggy Buzz YT group. You can, actually suggest, you can actually suggest more than, you know, like, Roblox experiences and stuff. Like, you, you can suggest Puggy Piggy Shorts Extras ideas, like, fails for me to react on YouTube, you know, like, um, like, movie trials or whatever, like, upcoming movies and stuff. Like, you can suggest more than, like, Roblox experiences. It doesn't have to be specifically Roblox experiences and stuff. Just make sure it's not inappropriate because you, you already know. Also, a quick note, though. If the Roblox experience you do suggest is not Xbox 4 in the moment, they'll basically just say on the group wall the Roblox experience you suggest is not Xbox 4 right now. But when it does become Xbox 4 in the future, I will most likely and hopefully remember to play it. Also, suggesting Skippy Tool Red experiences are not allowed. So, just a Skippy Tool Red experience, then boom, you can't be deleted, and that'll basically be the first one for me in exile from the group. Also, if you do suggest a Roblox experience, though, or, or ask me to play an update from a Roblox experience I did play before, and I still haven't made a video about it yet, there are either two things that are happening right now. Number one, I'm probably busy recording other, like, Roblox, like, Roblox, um, gameplays and stuff, because I usually record the suggest one last, or I'm probably busy with something else, you know, like, a like, a, like, um, an animation, or a completely different project that I haven't revealed or announced yet, you know, like, Piggy Analog Core. But don't worry, the Roblox experience you suggest will still be recorded, like, like, Upload it, yada yada yada. And it'll still be credited in the description below. Roblox profile or even by a chance a YouTube channel. Also, um, do not suggest me any Roblox experiences made by like people who on Roblox who have done no good things, you know, like big games, game fam. I explained this multiple times. Do not suggest me any Roblox experiences from like those two groups specifically. Your comment will be deleted, and it's not a warning. I should still want to be associated with playing like Roblox experiences made by people who have just known for having bad reputations on Roblox. Also, do not suggest me any Roblox R63 experiences. That one is very self-explanatory. You will be exiled from the group without any warnings and stuff. So, yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. PuggyBizYT is signing off right now, and I'll see you guys in the next video. And as always, peace out.